Senior Drill Instructor Dwight T. Barnes. The first and last words I want to hear out of your stinking holes is, Sir, do I make myself clear? Sir, yes, sir! My goal is simple. As of right now, you are all maggots. You will not speak until spoken to. You will not sleep unless told to do so. When I ask you to jump, you will reply with, How high? Do you get me? Sir, yes, sir! What's your name, dirtbag? Sound off like you got a pair! Corporal Shepard, huh? Looks more like Corporal Dog Meat to me. Seems your name was mysteriously bumped to the top of the advanced training list. My suggestion to you is to get your ass down to the training center and report to Drill Instructor Sharp ASAP. Now move it, Corporal. Where are you from, soldier? One, two, three, four. You call that. I've been ordered to stay here, sir. Dirtbag! I will smoke you like a Cuban cigar! <laughs> All right, maggot, listen up! I don't care what your previous outfit was like, but around here we do things my way! Follow my instructions carefully, and by the end of the day I'll have you eating danger and crapping victory! Now move your butt, soldier! I will meet you on the other side in the armory! Mounted on the wall below me, you will see a PCV! This is a powered combat vest! Use it correctly and I guarantee it will save your life! Your PCV is able to recharge from battery power, or it can interface and recharge with commercial, military, and HEV charging stations! What are you waiting for? Grab that PCV and get it fully charged! Trust me, maggot, you're gonna need it! I'll meet you in the next area to demonstrate some of your best capabilities! That normal set that your military has provided you with will keep you alive! Step over to the mark and this will be demonstrated for you!
Activate your night vision goggles to navigate this maze and exit on the other side. Now move like you got a purpose! <laughs> have what it takes to be a soldier. Now double time it over to the next portion of your training. Move it! Move it! All right, maggot, let's see if you can move your butt through my obstacle course. On your mark, get set, go, go, go! Run up and over those platforms. Move, move, move! Duck! Now jump! Get your sorry ass moving! Get your ass down that hill! Scale that wall! Hurry it up! My dear sweet grandmother moves faster than you, dirt! Get over that beam! I thought we were training soldiers here! Are you trying to embarrass me? Proceed to the next area! Come on, double time it! Move! 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 Let's see if you can climb faster than you can run! Ready? Very good! Maybe there's hope for you yet! Now, you wanna come up here and try to knock me off? You can definitely climb better than you can run! Now let's jump! Catch that rope and use your momentum to swing across that water! This might take more coordination than you have, soldier! I want you to swing from rope to rope and meet me at the end of the course! I'm almost impressed, soldier! Meet me in the next section and let's see if I can shake you up a bit! You better move like you got a purpose! Okay, soldier, this is a live fire exercise! This run will give you a taste of what it's like to be in the field. Keep your head low and move between cover. I want to see your face in the dirt, soldier. Go, go, go! Climb that rope ladder. Get your ass up there. Hit the dirt, soldier. Move it, move it, move it! Stay low! Soldier, move on for your next phase of training. Your weapon is your best friend. It is your only friend. And to be more effective, soldier, you must master your weapon. On the table, you will see your standard issue sidearm. Pick it up and step over to the pistol range. The object of this exercise is to familiarize yourself with the functions and use of your weapon. The goal is for you to place six shots within the inner circle of each target. You may begin! You may proceed to the next section of the training course. This exercise will train you in the use of a long-range sniper rifle. Proceed to the table, pick up the sniper rifle, and position yourself on the firing line. In this exercise, you will be firing at targets both moving and stationary at medium, long, and extreme ranges. As you will notice, your sniper rifle comes equipped with a scope. Use this scope to magnify your view, making the distant targets easier to see. In the distance, you will notice three stationary targets partially concealed. Hit each of these targets to advance to the next stage of targets. How you do 
with simple moving targets at that range, soldier. Very good. Now let's see if you can hit the moving targets at long range. Make sure to take your time and line up those shots, soldier. Make sure to take careful aim, soldier. Patience is key for those crucial shots. Not bad, not bad at all, soldier. Now let's see if you can do the same at extreme range. Unbelievable! You can actually shoot! I'd actually consider letting you cover my ass in a firefight! I'm finished with you, soldier! Proceed to the next area and report to the next drill instructor! Thanks, Corporal! Alright, dirtbag! You've proven yourself a capable grunt! Now let's see if there's any leadership qualities in that sorry carcass of yours! To become an effective leader, you must familiarize yourself with the skill set of each soldier in your platoon! The first type of soldier you will meet is the Engineer! Engineers have a knack for getting you in and out of places that are otherwise inaccessible! Take charge and have him follow you to the sealed door! Yes, sir! Stand back, Corporal. This should only take a minute. Once you've breached the room, proceed through the door and meet the next type of soldier. <laughs> the medic can be one of the most valued soldiers on the field. They have the ability to heal both you and your fellow squad members. To receive medical attention, simply hold down your use key and the medic will apply first aid. Once the medic has attended to your wounds, proceed to the next area to complete your training. Yes, sir. Listen up, soldier. During the course of your missions, you may not be in direct contact with your squad. In these situations, you will need to utilize any available military radios. These radios can be used to call in reinforcements or gain vital military intelligence. Approach the radio and use it, soldier!
I get to kill me something. I heard that. Watch your vector, Goose 3. It's getting a little time here. Yeah, this is another search and rescue operation. I'm going to be pissed. Yeah, I'm going to be pissed too when I got to search out and rescue your sorry ass. Anyone out there got a good view of the LZ yet? Negative, Goose 7. I can see some activity up there, but uh, I can't tell what it is. Hey, sir, I think Jackson has got the hot for it. Okay, Goose hey, people, power. we have an extremely hostile situation. Oh, holy shit, Goose 3 down! Goose 3 down! How is going on out there? So Watch it, Goose 7, you got something coming up on you. Three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, you've woken up. Corporal Shepard, is it? I've read the tag on your uniform. I'm glad to see my life-saving efforts weren't in vain. I can't say the same for him. I'm afraid you have been through a serious accident. Most of your friends didn't make it. I was hoping that you soldiers had come to rescue us, but now it seems we are all in the same situation. I think I saw a radio near the crash site where I found you. Perhaps you can go there and radio for help? Have, have you ever seen strategy? such a magnificent species? These crabs can completely control their host's nervous system. Can you imagine what the next stage of mutation looks like? that you troops may not actually be here to rescue us. Just don't forget about us out there, alrighty? Okay, I'll let you through now. Believe it or not, I was a wuss in high school. I know it's hard to believe. Good luck, sir.
This train is inbound. Please keep your legs inbound inside the train. Machines? Why don't these ever seem to work? Hey, uh, you wouldn't have a quarter I can borrow, would ya? Sure, I have nothing better to do. Seen the new IG-88? No, I haven't. But a friend of mine... Oh, oh, what, the... what is that, Doc? I don't know. I've never seen that species before. It's okay, sir. I can take him. Oh, ah! Ah! Oh. No! I don't want to die! Ah! Those poor bastards. You go on. Just slowing you down. I have a better chance of survival with you. Maybe I should guard that closet over there. Oh no. You're one of the them. Can't we just get along? Yes, let's go. I'm slowing you down, am I?
it you didn't find, Freeman. Forget it, Corporal. We are pulling out. The airstrike has started. Get to the hangar while we await evac. Where's Freeman? We don't have time to mess around. You've got to believe me. Freeman could be anywhere. I'm not letting ah. you go until you talk. Well, this is my post, sir. I seem to be seriously wounded. This is my post, sir.
got to get out of here. Listen to me, Shepard. Those things, they'll kill all of us. Soldiers under orders to silence the facility or these vile aliens. When all the fighting started, I hit I don't think any of them above have survived. Get back!
like somebody really right screwed away, up, sir. Corporal. Seems the brass bit off more than they could chew. Yeah, well, forget about Freeman. We've got to save our own ass. I will not fail you with us, Corporal. Squad, quiet down. Yes, sir. Stand back, Corporal. This should only take a minute. I got a bad feeling about this mission. I got your sick. Let's get the hell out of here! <laughs> Sniper school sure paid off today. I'll have you through here in no time. down to the extraction point near Lambda Sector. With any luck, we'll even get a shot at Freeman on our way out. Now, this transit system should take us there, but the door is sealed up pretty tight. Jeez, where's an engineer when you need one? You got it, Corporal. I'll be right behind you. Guard duty, huh? Why do you have to clean up a mess the grunts can't handle? Tell me about it. I just want to deliver the package and get out of here. Yeah. Sooner or later, the grunts are going to figure it out. I don't think... 
think I'm gonna sink. Don't worry, soldier, I'll have to get back to the He's a locksmith, huh, Shepard? <laughs> operations in the mission briefing. Yeah, I mean, we're all on the same team, right? Right? Well, I'm not sure what their mission is, At but your we command, need to keep sir. moving. There's gotta be a transit car somewhere on these tracks. Affirmative, sir.
It's ready. You must go now. Hurry up, Damon. I can't leave it open forever. mouth of the pipe and continue to press forward. Then jump up and while you're in mid-air, go into a crouch.
from its point of gestation. As before, we were still only able to coerce the creature into latching onto organic materials. Unfortunately, the administrator has called me down to the anomalous materials lab this morning for an important experiment, so I don't have any time to further my analysis. Take specimen number 1176 and log anything else you can find.
Hey, man, good to see you. Well, I can't believe you made it past those masked freaks. Those snipers have pinned us down here pretty good. We tried making a break for it, but they know we're here. They're just waiting for their shots, and those bastards are patient. That's what I'm talking about. Moving out, Corporal! Let's get the hell out of here!
Shepard! Hey, stand back and I'll cut it! We're gonna need your help! It's good to see you, sir. It's a real mess out there. I mean, these things are coming out of the damn walls! Ain't no way around them either! They just keep coming! Heard about some kind of big standoff at the dam up ahead. I say we make our break for it now. It ain't gonna get any better, that's for sure. And I bet they could use our help. I got your six! You got it, Corporal! I'll be right sure. behind you! We can do more damage that way! Shot, one kill. I'll stay here and await- Yes, sir! This might sting a bit. I'll I will not fail you, sir. Okay, I'll All secure right, this scout guard. ahead. Guard it right away, sir. Let's get the hell out of I here. I got your six. Peace is proving to be quite a challenge. I'm a natural born alien killer. Area secure, sir. All right, you scat your keeping you in one piece is proving to be quite a challenge.
Shepard, I don't know what those moving out are up to, but it doesn't involve getting us out of here alive. We've got no choice but to fight our way out. Let's go! I'll stay here Guard and await you. further orders. Okay, I'll secure this. the mortar field, but we're Cover. pinned down by a group of black cops. We'll open the bunker door, but you better get over here quick. I'll tag him. You bag him. Right away, sir.
me, and I'll tell you a secret. I've been hiding up here listening. These black ops have some sort of bomb. I think they're planning on blowing up the base. Now, now why do you think they would do such a thing? I'll just wait here. Are you crazy? I'm not opening this door until someone turns that bomb off. Be careful with that thing. One false move and this whole facility is gone. I've got it covered. You do right. <laughs> That was a close one. You better get in here. It's not going to be easy from here on out. The only way out is through the level 4 storage unit, but it's a mess down there. The Black Ops were using it as a staging point until the aliens came in. If you do make it through, make sure you have them come back for us. Okay, I'll cover you.
I guess you're a good guy. Listen, you've got to get down below. There's something coming through and it's the nastiest looking thing yet. Some of your buddies went down there a while ago and I haven't seen them. I've got some weapons I've piled up in here. You better take as much as you can carry. Because I think this is it. Good luck, Corporal.
So, Corporal Shepard, we meet at last. Please don't think that I've been avoiding you. A great many matters require my attention in these troubled times. I do hope you understand. And now I require a further indulgence on your part. I cannot close my report until every loose end has been tied up. The biggest embarrassment has been Black Mesa facility, but I think that's finally taken care of itself. Quite so. But there is still the lingering matter of witnesses. I admit I have a fascination with those who adapt and survive against all odds. They rather remind me of myself. If for no other reason, I have argued to preserve you for a time. While I believe a civil servant like yourself understands the importance of discretion, my employers are not quite so trusting, and rather than continually subject you to the irresistible human temptation of telling all, we have decided to convey you somewhere you can do no possible harm, and where no harm can come to you. I'm sure you can imagine there are worse alternatives. 